Right now we are on the train from Brandenburg to our hotel. And there are an gauge just in front of us. And uh, Mr. Orr sit over there because our luggage occupied this whole area. Olivia, look at all the graffiti. Yeah, especially that wall. How can people getting up there? It's so I high, know. right? Oh, they get onto the roof and they tie a, tie a rope, rope and then hang down and make the graffiti. That's my guess. Here is the Holiday Express. We're gonna stay here in Berlin. Oh, this is our room. A double bed and a, a hutang bed. I guess I'm taking the single bed. And this, uh, you're such a good guest, Olivia. Right so There's good. only one pillow there, so <laughs> there's your desk. School that's your school corner. We're gonna start school. Look, okay, not as fancy as the Venetian, but it will do. Yes, not bad for free. Feels like, um, kind of like IKEA ish, Vinny, right? Yeah. And tiny. And they got everything here. Let's bring our food back up here. Yes, here. I don't think, yeah, I think we're going to have to eat it down there, though. Olivia's desk, her hutang bed, or double bed. Does it have a bathtub? Shower, toilet. Does it have a tub? Our bathroom. Is there a tub? Shower looks nice, decent. Okay, let's go. Since we have a kit and uh, we did a free early check in and uh, including. It's only 9 30 a.m. and they let us check in. Yeah. And then we're going to have breakfast that's including too. So, in, um, in Europe, zero is the ground floor. First floor is the second floor. Oh, that's confusing. And minus one is Gro un underground. Underground. Oh, the first floor starts zero. Oh, Gra the ground floor is zero. Danny meat. Cereal. Milk for coffee. Coffee station. And green tea. And this is a different flavor yogurt, fruits, and juice station. You need the help, sweetie? You got it? Okay. You got a little cup first? That's uh, apple juice. So we're having our first meal in Berlin. I think we were going to eat like schnitzel or some German food, but no. It's the breakfast at the Holiday Express. Now normally, we wouldn't be able to do this, but since we got here so early and they let us check in early, they said we could go ahead and have the free Holiday and Express uh, breakfast, which is a little different than the American ones. And that you get a lot more breads with croissants and a lot of cold cuts. And you also have the pancakes, but no bacon or sausage. It's a little different, but still good. Chocolate in here. Oh, there's chocolate croissants. Oh, Olivia's loving it. Is it good? Oh, yeah. So if we had to go out to eat uh, breakfast, then it would probably cost us another 20 or 30 bucks. But this is one of our great money-saving hacks, is that uh, we get the free breakfast at the Holiday Express. Your pancake looks very fancy. It's two flowers. Super 
here I got four different flavor of liver spray and this one is milk protein and uh, I have some already put on. Let's try it. I like it. Mm. In the U.S., not many people eat those spread. Oh. I think uh, you, you can buy those liver flavor in the pet shop for the dogs or for the cats to eat. <laughs> Americans are that big on liver. Yeah. How is the breakfast? It's pretty good. A little bit different from the U.S. one. Mm -hmm. There's less uh, hot food, so there's no bacon oh. or sausage. Sweetie, you won't able to sleep tonight if you sleep more. Here's the map of Berlin. So there's Brandenburg Gate, which is a famous spot. You see this little S here? That's the train station we got off of. And so we walk down a little bit, and our hotel is probably like right down here. So now we're gonna walk up here, go this way, and there should be a mall right here. We gotta get, uh, we gotta go to the mall because mommy needs a new pair of shoes. We need to go to a grocery store, get and some water. My first time we go to a German mall. Good guess. And along the way, maybe we might try some currywurst. Do you know what that? Can you guess what that is? Sounds like very bad curry. You think that's a very bad curry? It is the famous food for Berlin. This is a grocery store next to our hotel. You buy a little grill for 11 bucks. 11 so, euros. Yes. Wow. Well, since it's about a dollar to a euro, it's about the same. About 12 bucks. So, the, Olivia, come here. So the other funny thing is, instead of decimals, they use commas. So we would have 11.99, they have 11 comma 99. Mm -hmm. We can buy a little grill, we've got grilling. That'd be awesome. Yeah. 11 bucks. Fruits, variety, everything. Fresh, you can squeeze fresh juice here. The produce. Oh, it's not bad actually. The lettuce is only like, um, uh, it's only like a two dollars under two dollars. Yes, because it's really easy right now because the one dollar to one euro is about the same. Yeah, the price is pretty decent though. Yeah, so before it used to be. Dollar uh, thirty gets you one euro. It's a little greenhouse. You just get the Thai basil. You just buy it while it's still oh alive. Oh my god, they're super fresh. Right? It's still alive. Yes, it's that's really true. Wow, this is really cool. Can get a salad here. Juice, cheese. Guess what this is? Mm, natural. Natural Min what? Mineral saucer. Mineral water. Natural mineral water. Oh, water is water. Yeah, so it's like, yeah, a lot of Mineral water. So a lot of the German stuff. You water. Kids, you don't know German, but you think about it a little bit more. You go, I know what that is. You can guess. Uh -huh. Can you guess what they how to say chips in German? Chips. Chips. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the wine area. Let me take a look at the wine price. Oh my God, this is so. It's only like a five bucks. Oh, that's even two dollars. Cheaper than soda. Dollar is a dollar sixty-six. There's a yeah rosé. Well, Whoa! Can that, mommy can just drink that whole bottle. I yes, I can just drink wine instead of water because it looks like wine and water is the same price, anyways. Whoa! This is only like under ten bucks. In the U.S., this one, the Aperol, is about like. A a way more than nine ten bucks though. Well, now it's domestic. The Bailey's is still like fifteen bucks. That's U.S. right? Yes. 
A fruit. Oh, we didn't look at the fruit aisle. I want to take a look at the fruit. It's grapes is only five gra five hundred gram. A uh, um, one and a half euros. Oh, kiwi. Fifty five cents each. Wow, this is definitely cheaper than U.S. Salad bar. This is a supermarket just right across our hotel. We stay at the Inn Holiday Inn Express. It's a little outside the seating area. You can grab food in the supermarket and sit outside. The building here is very boxy. Looks kind of concrete-ish. It definitely looks different than the U.S. street. Bikes. So we found a place for that. We got the ATM, we got money. And now we gotta find uh, some shoes for mommy. We can see the wall right here. Let's go look at the wall. So, the wall can be West Germany. Go East Germany. Which one is, oh, West that's Germany. West. Song is over there. West Germany, East Germany. Now it's that easy to cross. Back in 1961, you cannot, able, you are not able to cross the the wall. Yes, sure. Vernon loves you. That's a convenience store. I want to go buy get a bottle of water. Oh, just right here. Now I'm going to try some local food, uh, curry, uh, worst. It's a hot dog. It's a, a sausage with curry. Order on number one. Okay, here's our uh, first room of food. Uh, I think it's called curry worst, so uh, let's give it a try. Mm -hmm. Um, curry powder right there, yeah. What's good? What's and the red one? Ketchup? Yeah. Hot ketchup. Spicy? Uh, sour? A teeny bit spicy. A teeny bit sour. Not a lot though. It's good. It's good? Right. Okay. I have to have fry. Oh, mine is. It's fresh, crunchy. Gotta get this in the camera. Mmm. Well, friendly. It's good, right? A little sweet. And it's spicy, too. Combination like the sourness of the tomato sauce and a little sweet and then a little powder, which is the yellow powder. powder. It's curry powder and give a little cake. Mmm, pretty good. Try it. See this? This one? Wow. I really like this one.
Oh yeah. Oh, go over there, Olivia. Go over there. Hey, hey, hey. Selfie. You two, go together. Come on. Do I suppose? Go, come and walk to me. So cute. After I got on my shoes, now we're walking back to our hotel. You sure this is the right way? Berlin is a very walkable city. Yeah. People are here very fit. I think they're walking a lot, riding bike. Bike lane on the sidewalk. Yes. Cheers. My first German beer. Oh, it's really good. Very freshing. Wow. It's so good. I'm craving. What's the in this an American beer? This is a light beer, so it's not dark beer. I started with light beer, so thirsty, just arrived today. And, um, it tastes like a regular lager, I would say, light beer. It's our first dinner in Germany, and we're at the Stadt Klaus, the German restaurant. Uh, so this is a local restaurant. All we're hearing around us is German. So I think we're in the right place. So we ordered three things. First, we have a pork cutlet with potatoes. And we have a couple of giant meatballs, also with potatoes, and a salad. So it looks like German food does not have any cooked vegetables. They do like their salad so much. So we're going to give this a try and see how it tastes. Olivia, you want to try it first? Okay. 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 Sala is mine. Olivia's potato looks like a scallop. It's very pretty though. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think you're just supposed to dip it in the mustard. Give it a try with the mustard. Yeah, that would be good. It's like juicy, it's not bad at all. It's like super good. And then, it's not like chewy. It's nice and soft on the inside. Like any regular good meatball, except for it's huge. Try to cut it. That's pork chop. It's pork chop. It looks really good. I smell something really good. I couldn't tell which one is. Mm. Hot. Hot. Hot? Let me try the pork chop. Mm. Mm. <coughs> Not dry, pork chop, freshly fried, good amount of salt, good breading, good. Try the meatball, yes. See, what's the difference in the meatball we had earlier? Well, that was a sausage. Sausage? This looks like a hamburger good. party. Oh yeah, by the way, it's a potato, but soft, yeah. A little salty, but... It's like a hamburger patty. A little drier than that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you for following our journey. See you in our next video as we get soaked in the rain during our bike tour of Berlin.